Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and if you are a Microsoft Edge user, we uh, have another update. Uh, it's been a lot of little updates on Edge in the last week. Uh, security updates, but also bug fixes. Well, there's another one today, uh, a rare Monday update, uh, March 24th. So if you go into the upper right corner, three horizontal dots, help and feedback, and about Microsoft Edge, you will be pushed to version 134.0.3124.85. Now, it is to note that's interesting because on Friday, we had one that moved our version to .72. But there was also another one just a little later. And that one was pushed through the weekend. It was pushing our version to .83. And now, there's another update to .85. So, this one says just you know, various performance and bug fixes. Uh, one of the things that I know is that the in private mode could be crashing sometimes depending on how you use it, which was one of the fixes. There's a fix with the uh, different time zones that also had a glitch. And uh, so these are a few little bugs that are fixed here and there. Um, one that has been appearing for me, and I've seen somebody today mention it, which made me thought of talking about it, is that if you are using it on some machines, depending on the GPU that you have, the screen goes dark, goes like dark and really black for a few seconds and then comes back with the regular website you're watching. And it, it's kind of random and happens on some websites, not on all of them. Now, if you go and remove the hardware acceleration, it stops doing that. But the problem with doing that also is creating a new problem. In my case, if I remove hardware acceleration, then in YouTube, the videos are out of sync. What you see and what you hear isn't actually uh, synchronized together. So I had to put back the hardware acceleration which brings back sometimes a dark screen. So um, question to all of you out there, do you see a dark screen that appears for one or two seconds and then things come back on your Microsoft Edge browser? If so, what's your GPU? In my case, on this machine that does it, if we go to the task manager, you'll see that my GPU, which is an integrated uh, GPU, of course, with the... Uh, with the computer, um, so let me just uh, go here. So the GPU here is an AMD Radeon graphics uh, adapter, which is part of the machine. It does have its dedicated GPU memory, but um, apparently um, I would guess maybe it, hit, it is mostly these uh, GPUs that are hit. If you do have these little dark moments, uh, let me know and let me know your GPU. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.